Hello everyone, welcome at the North Side Live. Today we're gonna do some nails. And I was thinking to do my nails some ombre color. As you can see, you need a blue and purple nail polish. I took a blue color that's almost green, so like a turquoise color. And these are actually very, very, very old nail polishes. So it really doesn't matter which nail polish you use, everything is possible. You need a file as well. And some kind of sponge. And some nail polish remover. And then some cotton pads or some Q-tips if you have. First thing I'm gonna do is to file my nails. I'm filing my nails, babe. Oh yeah. And just excuse my half bluish, blackish nail. Because I've had black nail polish before this and uh, it doesn't get off really well, you know. <laughs> when we're done filing the nails, I'm just going over with some brush to get all the dust out of the way. And now I'm getting my sponge and I put the two colors on. First I do the purple and then next to it the blue and just pat that on your nail see there's my thumb and then I just pat it on the rest of my nails as well of course the first coat is very thin so we will have to do this a few times to get it really covering the nail. Actually my nail polish was a bit watery so uh, you might have better nail polish and it will be done in just two coats but I had to do it in four times. Between every coat you have to wait for it to dry but I can assure you it's very 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 fast because the coat is so thin it will dry very fast and we're going for the last coat tap 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 that's done don't worry if you have your whole fingers full of nail polish later we will get it off and we will get it over and done with then this is just optional but I had some stickers uh, from flowers and I thought I could put a little flower on my ring finger so I did it's a nice white flower with a diamond in the middle and this is optional as well, but I always do. I put some gel coat over my nail polish to make it last longer. Because normally when I only use normal nail polish, it will be ruined in maximum two days. And with this gel coat, I can easily go through a month and still have nice nails. So I will just put this transparent gel over my nail polish with this nice pencil I have. Don't you just love this beat? You can see my wonderful hair hanging here in the way. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Now the thing with gel is you have to let it dry in a lamp, in a UV lamp. So I'm just letting it dry two minutes in the lamp and then afterwards 
we take our nail polish remover and put it on the cotton pad or the q-tip if you have and then just remove all the nail polish that's not on your nail that's on your actual finger so we're just removing that and then we're almost finished Of course this is way easier with the Q-tip than with the cotton pad, but don't have that, so that's how we do it over here. Anyway, we're almost done, just make sure you get every little piece under the nail as well, because it looks a bit awkward if you still have nail polish under your nail there. This song sound like love shack baby love shack or is that just my feeling then that's done wow and I just have some oil to finish it up this is some pineapple oil I believe and I'm just Massaging my finger, my phalanges. And there you go! Beautiful ombre nails! They are so magical, I really love them. I never did them before, but I really like them. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe, and see you in the next video. Bye bye! Mwah, mwah.